Graham, how ready are your boys for this fantastic challenge tonight? I hope they're ready. They've trained really well. Um, it's going to be a brilliant night with a great atmosphere. So we've got some new people in the team this evening. Uh, it's up to them to experience this atmosphere and add to it uh, and make us better. And I'm, I'm really confident and I'm really happy and I can't wait to get going. Are you confident those new guys will be able to take it in their stride because you know a full house, a lot of expectation out there tonight? Yeah, we've brought them in here to experience this. We've brought them in here to actually add to what we're trying to do. And it's up to them to rise to the challenge. I'm sure they can. So a couple of new signings and you're starting 11 tonight. What do you expect from them? I expect them to be wide-eyed. I expect them to be um, slick and, and cultured. I expect them to work hard and understand our team shape. But I expect them to just go and be the maximum themselves. I don't, I don't really look at them as having to do a great deal more than what we've actually seen them do previously. They just have to go and be themselves. If they do that, then they will definitely add to what we're about. What do you expect from Aberdeen tonight? I expect them to be organised and, and aggressive and, and intense and play a really good tempo. Um, exactly the same as we always expect from them. And I expect... Uh, it to be a really good atmosphere because of obviously the manager and the past history of between the two clubs but I expect them to be right at it because we've just won two games against them they're not going to want that to stand um, and we have to be ready for that we have to be ready for their intensity and if we are we can go and hurt them with our quality so we have to make sure as we have done in the past we elevate our levels and, and try and get out of it with a positive result and make sure that we go and enforce our will upon them because that's what we need to be about. And the only one of your, your new signings not to start tonight is Jason Cummings when we see him later on? There's a definite possibility. He's been really bright and sharp in training. Um, and I look at that bench. We've got game changes on the bench. We've got people who can come on and change shape and structure. And Jason is really at the forefront of my thinking with that. Um, and he excites me. He's an excited person to have there if we need a change. Um, but also, he's an exciting person to chase the people in front, to make them excel, to make them be better than they have been. If we can do that, then we can be positive, not just for today, but all the way through the rest of the season.